My name is Tad Robinson, and I'm a singer, and I'm a harmonica player, and uh, I've been making music for most of my life, um, singing soul music, blues music, uh, whatever, whatever I'm called to do. You know, I always think it's kind of weird for a white cat to say he's a blues musician, but I am drawn to blues as a genre, and. Uh, some people recognize that when they hear my voice and the way I approach music. So um, I'm a, a journeyman blues singer, but you know, when you make a living out here trying to do this, you have to sing just about everything. So um, I'm drawn to, you know, songs like most singers, and I've sung in different, different um, environments, but blues and soul always seem to call me back. And so that's what I've been doing a lot of a lot of my career. Well, I'd be so much better off alone. Yes, I would. I'd be better off alone. I'd be better off alone. Yeah. Well, you know I need your full attention. I wanna have it. Yeah, I was still like high school or college age when I when I started to get interested in um, in blues, as opposed to when you're a younger person and you're listening to what's on, you know, in my case, AM radio in New York City, which was they played everything from you know um, Motown to the British Invasion, et cetera, You know that was going on back then. So, but then I started playing harmonica, and I think it was kind of harmonica was the key for me to uh, this music that really grabbed me, which was uh, people like Sonny Boy Williamson and Junior Wells and uh, James Cotton. Um, that's what really was the key that, that opened the door for me to discover that world. And that's where I've kind of uh, been, been camping out in that, in that uh, the house of the blues since, since those early years, because it really was interesting to me the way harmonica was used, because I played harmonica, but I never was hip to those, to the heavies yet, until I got about, about high school, college age, you know. Ultimately, music um, has to uplift people. You know, you can't, nobody wants to hear music that, that, I mean, the world is so full of trouble and danger and crazy people that most people are drawn to music as a way of getting away from all that. And so I find the role of a musician is uh, to, to, to create, you know, to transport people away from their day to day. And for me, that's what great blues music does. Um, uh, you know, it's a, it's a combination of the vocal, the, vo the voice, and, and, and the message of the music, but then the great uh, playing uh, of, of the musicians behind that and, you know, bringing that message uh, to, you know, to be strong and bring that message. So ultimately, just blues is like any music. And, you know, we're all musicians first, and then people slot us in what genre they think we belong in. So ultimately, you know, I'm a musician and I'm drawn to great songs, whether it be a blues or, or a rock or a soul tune. But generally speaking, I bring that flavor that people recognize um, as blues-oriented. Yeah. 
As we speak, we're kind of uh, working on a new project, and I'll be uh, giving you more information about that soon, but we have a record coming out on Delmark Records uh, in June or July of this year. So all, origi all original material, maybe, maybe one cover, but so far it's, it's all stuff that I've had a hand in the writing. Uh, I often write with other people, and that's been great teamwork. We have some, some fun, fun songs and, and some pretty cool things on the record, so I'm, even though I don't sound it, I am excited. <laughs>